Hey everybody, it's Blue Turtle, and welcome back to Super Mario Galaxy. Now that we've finished the game and started looking at the rest of the stars in the game. Uh, we also got a green star last time. But I think now that we got the green star in this level, let's actually head back to Observatory and probably head back to the fountain since we've got a few more stars left there to get. Nothing from the mail toad at the moment. So let's go all the way over to the fountain. Probably should have gone the other way. Might have gotten over here a lot faster, maybe. Okay. So. Battle Rock Galaxy. Let's head back in. And let's go to Top Maniac and the Top Man Tribe. So we've seen these Top Mans before, I guess. That's what they're called. They're the, uh, the spinny yellow, the small yellow like these guys down there, and then there are also the green ones and the red ones that we've seen. So let's see if we can find more of them. Oh, goodbye. Oh, flinging myself into space for no reason apparently. I mean, it would have been cool if I could actually get to where I wanted to go faster. But nope. Nope, oh, please. The power lines are keeping my friend locked inside. Hit them with something to cut off the power. Okay, well I will in a second. I just want to get this life up stream real quick, because that's useful. And these red spinny top men things, uh, you can't jump on them because they have the spike on top of them, but you can still get rid of them. Wow, that's so rude. I took damage after I took out the thing. Thank you, a sweet freedom. I'll show you a shortcut as your reward. And... TRANSFORM! Just gonna grab this coin to make up for my... pain. And let's go... Okay. Ooh. Let's go to that. And there's the pipe. Oh, and it's a 2D section. Okay, well, obviously I'm gonna take a shortcut, right? Oh, I can't actually reach that height just like that. Hang on, what happens if I ground pound? Nothing. Cool. I was wondering if I could actually, um, uh, what's it called? Like... Oh, I can't even think of words right now. I was wondering if I could... Oh, oh my goodness. I'm trying to... Go back so I can actually see the way you're supposed to go. Because you're not actually supposed to just get up there by going on top of that question mark block. You're also probably going to break the question mark block if you jump underneath it. This looks like fun over here. I don't think I've seen over here before because I just usually go... Straight through the other way, but we can hit the switch, which will flip us around. If these platforms push us up into the red bit, we'll go back down again, obviously. I can't even remember what I was talking about before. Oh well. Oh, go fast. And there we go. These red ones show that they actually crush you if you get underneath them, so you have to be careful of that. Okay. Top man person thing. Send me flying to where I need to be. Okay. What was that? Oh, so that, that's just the pipe. I thought that was spawning in like a one-up or something. But nope. But anyway, let's go up here now.
setting off an alarm apparently, or something. Oh, I did. Oh, I guess this is the top man's base. Like I was asking before, whose base is this and why are they keeping me out? But I guess it's the top man's, oh my goodness. And that's why they wanted to keep me out. Because I just blow up their entire world. But anyway, now that we're here, let's go up top. And there is a, um, a Luma that you can buy a live stream from. But let's go into this arena. And fight Top Maniac. Which is fairly simple to take care of. We just need to turn it off by jumping on, on, on onto it and then spin it into the, the electricity stuff. It spawns in some tougher enemies as you go along. Oh, and it's... They all like to spin you around a lot. Which makes things crazy. But there we go. Not done in Battle Rock yet. There's still two more stars left to get there. But also, let me check the map because there's probably comets to go get. Yep. Oh, and actually, there's there's another comet on Battle Rock. So I guess we should get that done then. There's just so many extra stars in this level to get. Daredevil Comet in orbit, which means we're probably going to be fighting Top Maniac. Yeah, Top Maniac's Devil, Daredevil Run. And the good news is I didn't take damage last time, so we should be alright. Should be. But you know, if it takes one hit for me to die, then anything can happen, really. Especially if you accidentally step on that electricity just walking into the arena. Okay, here we go. Don't touch the sides of Top Maniac as well. I don't think I mentioned that before, but that's still important to know. Okay. Just gonna get rid of these small top head people things. Oh, don't. Land on me! Please, good. Okay. That red one was gonna get me. Mario's blue. Very nice. Let's check the map again, once this is done saving. Okay, we still haven't got uh, Battle Rock completed, so let's actually go back there. And then, yeah. <laughs> Two secret stars. I think they're both in this one. So let's go ahead and do that then. Don't need to worry about star bits now that I've definitely done all that, but I might as well help because I also still need more star bits for other things as well. Oh, this is going to end badly if I get too close when there are two bombs about to blow up. Go, oh, please. There we go. So, one of these extra stars is obviously... The loom, the hungry luma, but there's also another one. I'm pretty sure there's another one. If I'm wrong, I'm gonna be kind of surprised because I'm I was so sure there was another one. But it's time for pain and suffering. This is a uh, the ammo depot. Depot. Uh, do not, not a garbage dump. What do people think they can just throw their trash here and it will be, it will magically disappear? 
Hey, we have plenty of bombs. Maybe you could use them to blow up all this trash. Sure, I will try. Gee, thanks. We have 30 seconds to blow it all up. So we need to be efficient and fast. We can possibly get... Oh, no, I'm getting stuck on things. Possibly get three chunks of trash in one go. Actually, I've got a lot more in that one. So maybe I'm a little bit wrong. Possibly. I'm, I'm quite happy to be wrong. Oh, that's not good. That's not good at all. Because it's not going to blow up in time. Please, 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 please. Nope. I think it's because I tried to do it too fast. There's always more, so come by again later if you feel like helping. Also, what's in the pipe? Does this just take me back? It does. Okay, well, I don't want- I don't- I don't want to be here. I want to go back. I want to go back, back. But yeah, this is, um... This is not fun. <laughs> Trying to blow up all of these things. Let me see if I can do it this time. I'm pretty sure I can do it this time. Now, I actually know what I'm doing. If you can get the further stuff first, that's pretty good, so... See if I can do that. Just have to remember to try and get it in the middle of the clumps. Oh, please be close enough. I really hope so. Yeah, let me throw that over there. That should be good. As long as that one blows up in time. Who knew that bombs work so well as an indestruct <laughs> industrial strength cleaner? Thanks, I owe you big. Oh, I know. Take this. I just found it lying around. Maybe it will help. Also, how did you get to this planet? This planet is brand new. And everything on it as well. So how did... Okay. Like, I know I left it for quite a while. But even so, if I went there earlier, all that stuff would be there, and so would that robot thing. But that was a Hungry Luma planet, which was created very... as soon as... yeah. Okay. Okay, Dreadnought, Ghost of Galaxy, and Gusty Garland Galaxy purple coins. Uh, Dreadnought and Gusty Garland are gonna be difficult. I think Ghost of the Galaxy is also fairly difficult. Anyway, let's go have a look at one of those. Probably Dreadnought, because I want to get that one done as soon as possible. Okay, just gonna grab this, because it's very useful. So it's... wait, which... which... is it engine room? I think it's... Is it engine room or is it this one? It might be this one. Maybe. <laughs> well, there I go. Oh, there's also Hungry Luma here. I want to see how much it wants. Probably more than I have. Come on, tell me. 1,200. So it's not as much as I thought it was. I did think it would be like 2,400, but nope, it's half of that. So we'll get- it will definitely get to that, just by playing normally. Okay, Dreadnought Galaxy, purple coins. And this is why you will remember this particular part of the level, is because of these purple coins. And this is a lot like the, um... The Battle Rock purple coins. Because we have to use these moving platforms and we have to not miss a single coin. So here we go. Probably just gonna grab that just so I make sure I don't die along the way. I'm trying to get all of these coins. Okay. Flip around. So far, so good.
This one's definitely harder. Oh, especially those ones there. There's also one in mid-air over here that you need to make sure you get. Which is supposed to be out of- oh no. Please go down, I need these. Oh, I need that one as well though. Oh, please. Please, Thwomp. You're ruining- no! Electricity, no, Thwomp! I'm dead. Those electricity things are really bad for your health. Also, the electricity there is uh, kind of not helpful because... I mean, I shouldn't be touching it though because of it. this level being... Like, it is 3D technically, but it's also kind of... You don't need to move back, forward or back, so... Oh, except for that one bit with the purple coins. Ah, why do they do it like this? <laughs> why? Why? There's that one, one platform with the three along it. And I think I should try to get the ones from the thwomp. Don't, don't, why? Ah. Oh. He jumped so far. I'm already struggling with this. This is why you will remember this particular one. Okay, just be careful. We have a 1-up that keeps respawning here, which means we don't probably won't game over from doing this. Please don't touch me. I just need to be patient and actually wait for these platforms to move. Except for that bit with the thwomp, because if I get left behind, I'm in trouble. But there are quite a few platforms there to help me deal with that. Okay. Let's go, grab these, and also grab that one. And I'm going to go underneath the thwomp first because that's probably just going to be way faster. Yeah, that was really good. Making really good time. Oh, there's only one platform there now. The rest of it is gone. That's good to know. Also, that one there is difficult if you miss it, so make sure you grab that one. Oh, this is not good. This is not good. This is not a great angle. I think it's actually 2D here, so you can't... No, you can go forward and back still, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. That's unfortunate, because you really want to make sure you're in line. Okay. Go, 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 go. This is still fine. I think this is actually the bit with the platforms that I was thinking of. Yeah. I'll grab these ones. Oh, there's so many on these platforms. Okay, good. Great. Just need to dodge everything, and now we actually have to go over there. There we go. Let me just bounce again so I can get over here, and oh no. I have, um... Oh, pain. I have pain. I have 99 coins. But luckily the last one is in midair. So there we go, we actually did it. Wow, you did it! Wow! You really worked for it. Oh, yes I did. There we go. It's time to check the map again. So I don't know about Battle Rock anymore at the moment, so I'm going to double check that to see if there's an extra star there. I thought there was. On the, uh, like it's, it's very similar to the other one. What's this do? Oh, that links all the way down to the garage. That's very useful, and I should have activated that a lot earlier. Because that's very useful. Hey, Luigi. Bro, you're looking for power stars, right? Let me help. I think you might uh, have missed one in Good Egg Galaxy. If I find it, I'll write you a letter. Keep your eyes peeled for it. I shall do. I will keep my eyes peeled. That sounds like a weird expression, but I will keep my eyes peeled. 
Just don't think about keeping eyes peeled too much. But anyway, let's go... Okay, there isn't one there. I was so sure. Maybe it's a Super Mario Galaxy 2 thing that I'm thinking of. Oh well. So I guess now we should actually head to a different dome. And I can't remember. That's going to put me right back up there. I can't remember which domes I have stuff left to do. Hang on. Isn't there like... I think there's a, a way to check that. Although I might just be wrong. And I think that's a Super Mario Galaxy thing. Um... Yeah, I don't think it's gonna tell me. I don't think it will even tell me on... on the map screen. Oh, maybe it will. Hang on, list? Okay, list. This is what I need. I'm pretty sure. I don't know if it's actually gonna show me the ones that I don't have, though. Oh, my goodness. I wish it showed the blank spots after a bit. Nope. Guess not. Okay, if I do this I can see. So yeah, this is a this is this is what I should do for now. And Ghostly Galaxy and Beach Ball, I guess I should do those two. So let's head over to the kitchen. Just have to press A when aiming at uh the level you wanna check. It's got a ghostly galaxy. Beware of Baldergeist. Also, I like the sky. I just want to point that out again. It, 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 I, saw, I pointed out that I liked it in a different level. But it's also in this level, so. Anyway. Let's get ourselves going again. And there's a chain chomp that I need to dodge. There's also a lot of these bats here. Ow. Oh my gosh. Mari, get up, please. Thank you. So let's head in to the mansion. And now, we have a new type of boo. These, these particular types of boos, if you spin near them, will spin around you, and you can break things with them. So let's just spin you right around to places. Toad, do you have anything to say, Toad? Spin! Uh, bomb boos, when they hit something, they go boom. <laughs> There's the perfect example. You can also get them to kind of follow you into things that you want to break. Hang on, there we go. Now we can get into this fireplace and launch star ourselves, although there is that block there, but we don't need it. Okay. I'm just gonna be very careful. Be very careful. Okay, never mind, I'm dead. Okay, so being careful, <laughs> being being careful. Let's just spin into you and then kick you or spin you again. Ow! Okay, being careful. Oh my goodness, he's swinging. He's swinging. I'm just gonna launch myself away. Get some more star bits, which I think are based on a particular candy. Okay, I love the sound that it makes when you're just doing the swinging around. It's just boing, 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 boing. Okay. 
Oh, one up. Wow. Just a free one up, I guess. But anyway, we need to get these uh, pool star chips. So let's go ahead and do that. And I think I can grab this one by doing that. Yeah. So I think I want to grab this one first. Probably. So let's do that. Oh, please land in that. Thank you. Grab that. And then... They're the pool stars. Oh my goodness. Boing. It's very quiet, but you can still hear it sometimes. Oh my gosh. Okay, we still need to pull ourselves through this planet, which is a little bit difficult sometimes. Oh, especially if it drops us. Because we need to not be holding onto a pool star too long. But also, that shouldn't just drop me when I'm trying to get into it because of it not working. So here, let me try this again. Oh, there it goes. Oh, didn't mean to do that. That's okay, I'm still here. Grab that. Okay, let's do this again, and this time without accidentally dropping ourselves. And actually just going straight through the planet. Okay, then. Let's go over to another planet. I don't exactly know what this wants me to do. This is bouncy inside of here. I guess we just have to make our way over to the launch star. Okay. And now, for a special friend. There's a Luma here, but I don't want to feed him right now. So this is Bouldergeist. He's a ghost of made up of boulders. Who can throw boulders around. The black ones turn into the booze though. Or the dark ones. And I believe if you shoot star bits at those ones, they also can be broken down quicker. So you can try to do your attack. You need to dodge these pillars that he can make out of the ground. We can also spin those to get rid of them quickly. Here we go. Hit him three times, and now he's in a weaker form, so let's see if I can actually get one of these bombos to actually hit him in his weak point. But now he's angry, so we need to dodge his fist attacks. And the other thing about having his fist there is that if we don't, don't do our bombos, fling our bombos around well enough, um, they will just break the hands down, so that's going to be a bit of a problem. But if we're close, like if we're right in between him and the bombos, we can get them going fairly quickly. You also have to be careful not to hit another bombo with a bombo. But there we go. But I didn't do very well. Because I got hit a few times. And can you guess what comet is going to be here soon? Also, apparently there's something important that needs to be said because I'm over here now. What's up? You have a letter from Luigi. Bro, I got a star, but now I can't get back. This picture shows where I am. Help me. Hmm, where is that place? Uh, it looks familiar, but then again... Let me give you this picture, so you won't forget where Luigi is. To view a picture, press plus to access the pause screen. Then use the letter icon to check the picture. Okay. Well then. I've got a few comments to do right now, though. So for now, that is it. So thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all next time.